How's it going, everybody? Arcadia back here with some more Let's Play Dishonored. Last time, we took out the High Overseer, and we made our way back here to the bar, and the Houndpits bar, and we're heading over to meet with the Loyalists after a successful mission. So, let's see how it went. Hey, guys. What's up? Thank you. Somehow you took down the High Overseer Campbell against the army. I knew you were on that. With Campbell gone, we've hurt the Lord Regent in measure. And with Martin back, we'll have the finest strategist alive. The Lord Regent must be shitting himself in Dunmore Tower. <laughs> yes, and oh, Campbell's yeah. journal, let's not forget. Our hope is that in these encoded pages, the location and condition of Emily Caldwin can be discovered. Our entire movement will mean nothing if we can't place the rightful heir on the throne. Nice shot. Nice shot. We must act fast. No doubt the Lord Regent is holding Emily somewhere, waiting to reveal him, to step out as the hero and further cement his regency. If he doesn't bring the young lady forth soon, nice there will be infighting among the nobles as to who should succeed the Empress. Nice shot. Yes, time is against us. But now you should take a well-earned rest, Corvus. We will decipher the contents of the High Overseer's journal and share them with later. All right. You good? No, not you. Sorry, Sam. You good, Sam? Why, there is something to you, isn't there? Yes. You went and spanked the high overseer in his own house. I hope the tools I designed for you function to your satisfaction. Yep, it should do. I am standing here and talking to you affirms that this is true, in several ways. Yep. I spanked him real good in the face can with I a very a hot stick. Yes, you can. Let's see. New upgrade available. Oh, yeah, sorry, because we got that sick. So, I have 963. So, what we'll do is purchase Mask Optics 1. And now... Buy some of those. Go back over. And we'll go with Mask Optics 2. Cool. Thank you. So how do, how do I... Forget how to do that. Uh, hold on. Options. Controls. Zoom. Left alt. Okay. Let me see. Left alt. Okay. F. Hello. Okay. Cool. Like it. <laughs> Actually, let me check this again. Um, pa always wanted me to be an overseer. If he could see us now. Yeah, he wouldn't be happy. You throw it out there. Right, let's go up. Don't know why that song came to my head, but uh, it did. So we're just gonna roll with it. Oh, boop. Okay, thank you. Require some assistance. That's what I thought. Okay. Sleep. I'll go to sleep now, me. Ah, oh, good night, me. Sweet dreams, me. Thanks, me. Martin is on his way to join the loyalist cable. So, oh, okay, never mind. That's what we just read before. Learn about weepers. Talk to Admiral Havelock. Have luck? More like was luck. Uh -huh. uh, uh, okay. Okay, just me. Alright, thanks guys. Alright. Uh, let's see where he's at. Every citizen's duty Kobe. Treasonous speech and action. The state depends. Hello. Hello, Corvo. I expect Martin will be joining us shortly. Probably. I hate to start your day with such a strange matter, but the servants heard something last night. Moving through the storm drains beneath the building. Most likely a weeper, this poor bastard. There's no hope for them once the plague gets that far along. 
nothing more than a shuffling corpse full of sickness and insects, if you ask me. I'd appreciate you investigating, just to be sure it's not a nosy guardsman that's getting too close. Here's a key to the hatches. I'd send a servant down there, but they'd die of fear on the spot, I'm afraid. Maybe Piero can concoct some sort of sleep poison for your crossbow if you want to go that route. There you go. I already have some. Going down. Hello. Who's in my sewer? This is not where you belong. You need to get on out. See, hold on. Ah. Oh, really? A two for you, say? All right, those people. Ah. Let's see. Oh, don't you run away? Boop. Nope. Wrong. Thank you. An ancient note. I'm sorry, but I won't be here for the next meeting, or ever again for that matter. What happened here was unnatural and makes me sick to recall. I left the results of our labors here for you to keep, but I expect that the rats will consume it before you returned. Bye, bitches. He didn't say that. I added that part. I'm sorry, I lied. Whoop, nope. No heart. Okay. Is there two? Oh, there's... Yeah! You were hiding... I can hide from me. Not today. Alright. Let's check out those powers. Ben time. Yes, please. Press right and slow the world around for a little time or until you press right to click again. At level 2, time is completely stopped. Enemies and security systems are unaware of you for the duration. Cool. So now we want to get to level 2, which means we need 8 runes. Jeez! We're going to unlock Blink level 2, I think. Yes. Now I can go really far with that. Cool. So, I guess we're just going to keep moving. Boop. Now we'll just look back up. Well, if you would let me actually get up there, that would be nice. Thanks, Have sweetheart. They want to talk to you. Close. Beautiful. They want to talk to me? Okay. Sorry if you guys can hear me munching on this cough drop. Mmm, tasty. Hey, guys! Just a weeper. Horrible. Or two. I trust you remember Martin, an overseer before, and... Perhaps again, someday soon. I owe you thanks for my rescue. Indeed. You've given us a glimmer of hope, Corpo. Because we've gotten what we've wanted from Campbell's journey. You've done it. We know where Emily Caldwin is being held. The Golden Cat, of all places. A bathhouse for aristocrats. Little better than a cursed brothel. But there's an unfortunate twist. It appears that Pendleton's own kinsmen stand in our way. The twins, Morgan and Custis. Not only are they controlling Emily, but they have the controlling parliamentary votes we so desperately need. Yes, the Pendletons have to die. But most importantly, Emily must be brought here safely so we can protect her until the Lord Regent and his entourage have been dealt with. Okay. Pendleton's waiting for you on the dock. He's asked to brief you personally. I think it's best. Fair enough. You know, we're about to go kill his brothers, so... Pendleton! Golden. Corvo, not as a patron, mind you. I designed... Corvo, I've asked to speak to you myself. Okay. You see, I'm sending you to kill my older brothers, Morgan and Custis. They're horrible men. It's true, as you may have heard. Cruel beyond words. You got some problems, man. My brothers are close allies to the Lord Regent. And as long as they are in Parliament, 
We cannot gather the votes we'll need to stop the Lord Regent from further consolidating his power. These days, they're best known for exploiting their favor with him to cheat others out of their wealth. Let's just say that not every family evicted and quarantined for having the plague actually has the plague. I warned my brothers in every way I could. I really did. But they never did listen to me. They'll be at the Golden Cat tonight at their usual revels. They'll be protected by the City Watch, so it'll be dangerous. Now go. Please do it before I change my mind. Okay. Sound like douchebags, so. Hello. Where? Did you. Boy, did you go upstairs? I need you to stay downstairs at all times, my dude. Do you need ammunition or weaponry? Would you like me to craft Can you let me open the menu? Thank you. Oh. Ah. Oh. How many do we have? So we have eight, and I need two at the, for this mission. So we ha can only use six at the most. So I'll have to choke other people out. Works for me. Samuel, buddy. Old pal. Old geezer. My main squeeze. What's up? I'll take you to the Golden Cat when you're ready. I've taken Lord Pendleton enough times, believe me. Fair enough. Alright, Sammy boy, let's go. I'll put on my mask of death and destruction. Sorry, I got intense there for a second. Alright, loading screen. Gonna have some water. The loyalists believe that Emily is being held at the Golden Cat by the corrupt aristocratic Pendleton brothers. These men are Lord Pendleton's despised older brothers, twins, older brothers, twins, and they are loyal to the tyrannical Lord Regent. Find Emily at the Golden Cat and eliminate Lords Curtis and Morgan Pendleton. <sighs> Can't do. Sorry if you guys, I need to get a better chair. This one's like, Squeak. I'll get you as close as I can to the <laughs> Sorry. cat, Corvo. You'll have to go the rest of the way on your own. The entrance is near Holger Square. Near Holger Square, all right. The thing is to make sure that little girl, Emily, gets back all safe and sure. Them two Pendletons are there, so I'm guessing there'll be a lot of guards. Slackjaw might have some ideas on helping you get inside the cat, if he don't kill you. This here's his territory. He and his Bottle Street gang hole up at the old Dunwall Whiskey Factory. They right. sell the elixir that folks use to fight off the plague. I'll lay low, but keep an eye out for you and the little lady you're bringing back. Good luck to you. I know Emily must mean a lot to you. Thanks, Sam. Be careful going up the street, Corvo. A river hand I know pulled up alongside me last night and said there's one of those watchtowers on Clavering now. I guess you getting rid of Campbell shook up the Lord Regent. Fair enough. Oh, damn. Your actions affect the city. A high number of deaths resulted more rats and weepers, different reactions from your allies, and darker final outcomes. So, yeah. Your fashion a high number of deaths result in more rat. Okay, so you want to try to keep your deaths as low as possible. Vision. Okay. That's something that I was not doing to the best of my abilities earlier. I was using blink at the opportune times. So, we could just go straight to the Golden Cat and find our own way in. However, we are going to go to the Dunwall Dis Whiskey Distillery once again. Once we go visit our dear old... Oh, she's gone. Never mind. Hey, you're just a man I swear. Oh, yeah. Okay. Okay. That him? Yeah, he's the one. Hey, 
We got a message for you from Slackjaw. Oh, yeah. He wants to talk at the distillery. Okay. Y'all have fun with that. Going in. <laughs> I'm a popular guy, what can I say? I don't think they're gonna last much longer in there. That's what they get for taking free swigs from the still. That chain of elixir is bad stuff. Hold on. I'll be waiting for you. Easy, easy. You just need a bit. Ain't you heard? Slack jump. Gross. Okay, so I don't know how we're gonna get to that one. So I was trying to find out. Okay. Pardon me, gents. Guess we're going to talk to Slackjaw. Pardon me. Here's a villain if I judge your looks aright. A villain I might have some work for. Somebody put plague in the brew tank. Half my men are weepers. Trap three of them in the distillery. That. Rest are wandering in the street. Since it's so and I find myself short of able bodies, I may have a point of interest for you, see? Way I figure it. There ain't nobody worth killing round here except those two Pendletons over at the Golden Cat. I'm right, ain't I? See, slack your nose. Them boys are twins. Rich, mean, and weird. Worse than most of their ilk. They've been laying low there a while, not sure why. There's a lot of security at the Golden Cat tonight, though. Special guests and the like. But you're gonna walk in there dressed like that and kill the Pendleton brothers? Maybe I got a better way to take care of them, too. If you're doing something for me first, understand. Someone, I don't know who, is killing my men, taking my territory, stealing my goods. Might be a fellow name of Galvani. I sent my best man to investigate, but he went missing and... Well, now I need someone to find what happened to him. Go to this Galvani's place. He lives nearby off Clavering Boulevard. You do that for me, and I'll get your better way into the Golden Cat. Deal. Let's go. Taking some stuff before I go. Thank you for the free stuff. All right. All right. So, there's our next mission. Whoa. Okay. No, thank you. I will not. Gross. Y'all have fun with that? Uh, Slack job. I'm sure you. I'm sure you've got that. Um, I will be back, however. Hey, blow on that chopper. Old town. They're after me. Boop. What was that? Nothing. Okay, so now we could. Jerk? That is my ghost. I guess mine is bottled. Hate him drink? Oh, you fucking bastard. How much they give you? I said I hate telling you that. Huh? 
Nothing? Waste time solving who killed him. Personally, I'd buy who did it a drink. But what are you gonna put on your report? I'm gonna say we found one of Slack Chuck's men inside, all dead and bloody, and that you are a stinking idiot. checking out. No, it's not. Let's see. Uh, mission clues. Mission items. Crowley's last message. Okay, back to Slack job. Okay. Turn that off. Gosh, I love having a longer ranged blink. It makes getting around so All much right. nicer. I give up. Oh my gosh, sir. Hello. How are you? Um, I hope you're having a good day. Bye. I gotta go. Must be cool. The Bottle Street Boys are fighting those two. Which gives us plenty of time. Excuse me. Boop. Boop. Alright. Yeah, see how great that makes getting around. It's fantastic. I wonder if his weepers are funny. Hey, no. hey, hey, wait a bit. What just occurred to me? How come it's always me who paid for the whiskey? Shush up your mouth. You know I can't work out the rest of the coin. Oh, cool. Oh, this is open. What do we get? Acrobat, you climb slightly faster. That's nice. Motor fuel PP. I don't think we really need that one. Go for this one instead. That's that's nice. Alright. Okay. Oh, he's right here. Here's Crowley's last words. What's this? Information from my missing guy. Let's have a listen. Alright. I'm down. Slackjaw. It's me, Crowley. I'm making this in case I don't make it back. He was right. There is someone once you dead. Want to take over the distillery and the whole Bottle Street gang. And you'll never believe who it is either. At first I did. That's why it's taking me so long. I wanted to be sure and what's that? Ah! No! No! Ah! So Crowley's dead. Too bad. He was one of my best men. Still, you and me had a deal, and Slackjaw never goes back on a deal. Take this key. It ain't for the golden cat, no. This key's for the captain's chair. A hotel abandoned since the plague gutted this part of town. Take the stairs to the top. You can use the roof to get into the Golden Cat Brothel. See that? Slackjaw keeps a bargain. Just as good as the men who run the city. Maybe a little better. You think about that. I will. Now maybe we can help each other out again. What's up? I could get rid of the Pendletons for you. Quiet-like and without killing them. But you gotta do something for me in return. The cat's having a big reopening tonight. 
Lot of money clients. Including an arts dealer name of Bunting. He's got particular tastes, or so I've been told by some of the ladies. Got some pretty fancy stuff locked away at his place. And the only thing preventing me from nabbing all that loot is the combination to his safe. Of course, the Pendletons have been camped out there for months, too, not sure why. So that means a lot of the City Watch and other soldier types. Bring me that combination, my masked friend, and then I take care of the Pendleton brothers. Just like that. You ain't never even gonna touch them. And I promise, I won't kill them, and no one will ever see them again. Now if that ain't a deal, Slackjaw don't know what is. That does sound like a good deal. Sounds like a fantastic way to take care of the Pendleton brothers in the, for our pacifist run. So let's just go right on ahead and take care of that. Besides, I'm sure that, that uh, Lord Pendleton will be very pleased with that if we are successful with it. So. Oh yeah, you guys are still here. Uh, boop. The boop. Thanks, guys. Appreciate it. What do you got? Crossbow bolt. Crossbow bolt. All right. Oh hey, it's you. Hey Griff. Want to look at some of the things I've found? Yes, I do. Good prices, I swear. Uh, I don't. I don't think I've got any more gold though. Have I? Fifty-three. Nope. And they're way more expensive than bureaus for the sleep darts. Okay, so Golden Cat. It's over there. Well, since we've already. Oop. Okay. We're just gonna take ourselves a little dive over to the other side. And then up there. Okay. How does it work? No, guards not to you. Woo! Alright, those rats will take care of them. Swarm of rats. Out real well. Boop. All right, guys. Fair warning. There's gonna be some mm, lady parts. All right. The upcoming area is riddled with pathways that will allow many approaches to accomplish your mission. Look for overhead ledges with rat. Look for overhead lat little <sighs> overhead ledges, rat tunnels, water passages, and hiding places. All right. I'm actually sorry about this little bit of noise right here, guys. I'm actually gonna move this mic over a little bit. Hopefully this sounds a little bit better. It was a little off to the side of me. I don't remember why I put it there, but this should sound a little bit better. So sorry about that if it sounded a little far away. It already sounds way better like over my thing. Art dealer's just right there. What? That's great, great. Drop high before landing on perform drop session. You will take any damage from the fall. Ah, I wish I could do this like without killing him. Let's do that. Okay. How do I? How can I get in there? Maybe I have to go lower. I'm just gonna choke you from the table. There we go. Shh, 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 shh. Okay. What will I do now? So how do we get this here, art dealer? So we're gonna punch him near me. You are really calm about that, sir. Really quick, if the 
there's a rune in here. Thank you. Cool. Send us food, not bullets. That's nice. Who knows I'm here? No one knows anything. Oh, it's you. Sorry, ma'am. Hate to have to do it to you. But I gotta. Real quick, just gonna park, pop this. Aha! How can I get to that? Out of that. Okay, uh -huh. well. Did you get back up there, please, Barba? Thank you. Let's see. T. Oh no! We out of mana. That is dreadful news. I'm not gonna lie, your boy's hitting the panic button a little bit. Excuse me. Wait for him to turn around. Come on. Come on, go the other way. Thank you. Gosh, people are so rude. There we go. Okay. That did not go well. I know you're somewhere around here. What the? Pendletons are here again. Rich and mostly clean. Can't ask for more than that. But they're drunk. I can't stand that. It doesn't matter, though. Morgan took the ivory and the blue ear. Cuss dishes up in the snow for me with Violetta. Duncan joined me in that. Oh, no, not tonight. Be crazy. Come on, you use that thing on it.
This is the week's supply of laser tiger laser to drink up, but the boss says we have we got to have coin in payment, no more trades. isn't it? Okay. Oh, wait. I think that that one will move over that way. In theory. Come on. Could you move, please? Please? Okay, just don't notice me then. Ladies, all right. Let's see here. <laughs> Sorry, madam. Master key. I know we're running low on beds, but I must have a room for the child. She's more important than you can guess, and, re and sh recently she almost got away using the VIP entrance. That's why I decided to keep the master key in my possession. The girl must be cared for, even if she's a brat, and I don't want her kept in a room to herself. Madam Prudence. Thanks for the key, madam. Oh, praise the lord. Boop. Excellent. Thank you for that. Are these all the different madams? Looks like it. Maybe it's not. Maybe it's just pictures of ladies. The boldest measures are the safest. Are they? Okay, there's no one out there. So let's see. Ivory room. Our dealer's over there. Okay. So we'll keep moving up. And now we can pop this to actually really see. Excellent. Take all that. We get another one of those. Anything else over here? No, all right, just the chest. Trust Pearl, 50, 50, 20. Cool, 120 gold right there. Okay. Okay. We're just kind of sneaking around gathering some supplies while we can. Emily. Okay. So, coin, coin, this one, herbs, coin. Thank you for the food. Coin, food. People be getting high up in this bitch. Alright. So we won't quite go for that yet. We can, and then we can also tell her to wait. But there's no point to just yet. Nice. You have a rune, ma'am, so I'm gonna have to do this. I apologize. Okay. Thank you. You also have other stuff like this. 
I know we're robbing people that are like literally selling their bodies for money, but maybe this will help them like that this is not the life that they want to live. Okay. Or maybe it is, you know, I'm not here to judge people. Whatever you want to do with yourself. Whatever makes you happy. Alright, let's see. Where can we go? So the art dealers are over there. Pretty sure that this floor is safe. Nom 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 nom. Talk to that nice girl again. The one I told you about. You realize you're at the golden cat, right? Yeah, but she's different. She really likes me. <laughs> Idiot. She likes your money, not you. You're just jealous. Shut up. Huh? Also, fun fact. Sorry, I feel like I was just sitting there and I was saying stuff in my head, like quite literally. I was like, "Oh yeah," and then, we'll, and then I never said any of it out loud. I don't think so. Corson, aristocrat. Okay, y'all look like you're having fun. Oh my gosh, more apricot tartlets. Ah, oh. delicious. But yeah, uh, oh, they're moving. Awesome. through the place like the outsider himself. Maybe the plague's driven him crazy. He didn't fight plague, man. He had discipline. Mark me. You get that mask off, and you'll see a weeper. Know what I think? He's one of Dowd's. That's how he fought. Like a shadow. You've been reading too many scary novels. You think I'm scared? You're shaking like a little girl. Uh. Don't show up Caldwell's Bridge. Hold up. Y'all yeah, about to move? You are excellent. Hello. Shush now, little baby. You are scared, and this is the mask that you'll never see. That was I th that sounded badass in my head. I think did it sound as badass out loud? Probably not. Cool. All right. Moving on. So we got a. Uh, I've been a little silent this episode. I don't know why. I think I'm a little tired. In all honesty. So. Yeah. Should do some laps. See who all I can find. This is the smoking room, which is where one of the Pendleton brothers is. Shh. Don't be like that. Don't be like that. No. It's a bad guard. Weirdo. People. Mind, people, mind, mind your own business. What I'm trying to say. Now then. What's he doing in there? Anyone you want. The High Overseer, for all I care. Never been this drunk. Some of my friends say I look like Lady Boyle. <coughs> Waverly? That lucky trollop. If I'd found those crystal deposits on my estate, I'd be throwing parties too. I'd be buying the Lord Regent's favor too, instead of begging for money. I, I didn't mean to upset you, my lord. Wait. Wait. On second thought, maybe you should dress up like her. Yes, I think I should like to teach her a lesson. I would be glad to, my lord. Will you like me in white or black? Or red, perhaps? Let me think about this. Waverly did always like black. Or was that Lydia? 
Interesting. That's actually a clue for later. Fun fact, guys. It'll make more sense when we get there. But, yeah. Where's that? Where's that? Art dealer still below. Us. Okay, so he's still just chilling down there. Okay, there's the art dealer. He's in there. Okay. Was that? I know you're some. Oh no! Oh. no. Assassin, okay, someone help. help me! Oh, that's unfortunate. Sorry. Help me! Firing! No, you're not. Hello? Oh. Okay, Who is that? Help me! Whoa! Someone kill this man! Help me! You are not. Could you move? Jeez, you dick. Nope. Well, too bad. I thought that was an art dealer's room. That's my bad, guys. I'm sorry. No, you don't. You don't know nothing. Okay, just look really quick. So here's what we're going to do, guys. You're here somewhere, scum. Okay. Just, oh. Could oh, you not? You. Oh, you piece of taint. I will find you soon enough. No, you won't. That's too bad. I demand that you show yourself. Okay, let's wait and see where this card goes. I'll write to her again. She has to see reason. the shock at my command get it and the what safe is? word tonight will be retribution let's say What's you hear that you stop one uh, shot out of line and you are out of a job check everywhere I know you're here. why did they check in there i will find you soon enough I was stupid. I Sorry, guys. I was focused on like listening to what the art dealer said, and then those guys were like, "Hello," and I was like, "No!" <laughs> we'll oh, shut the fuck up, Morgan. God damn. Oh. When I find you, it's gonna be bad. Is it? <laughs> there we go. Now, Morgan, if you could just shut the fuck up and leave me alone, that would be great. 
Stay focused, please. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, that's good. I deserve that one. Shall I tell you why? The Pendletons are here, right? I'll start with them. I've cheated them, robbed them of thousands. Oh, you're ruthless. Don't hold back. I'll tell you everything. The Pendleton's inheritance was worth hundreds of thousands at least. I told them it was junk. Oh, ah, retribution! Retribution! Oh, that was perfect. But it's all I can take for tonight. Call my servants. We're done. Are we? I can tell you love your work. Careful. I have a condition. Really? Well, that's interesting, because, um... Hi! Uh, we're done, I said. Retribution! Now let me out! I'll have you whipped, you bitch! Well, yeah. this what do you want the safe yes of course the combination is eight seven nine take anything you find I think I felt my heart skip uh, uh, please, just... my heart won't take this ask me anything I screwed the Pendletons yes and, and I've been to the Brimsleys they worship the outsider I've seen it I did it too what else? That's, I, I'm not comfortable with doing it anymore, so. That'll be the last one we do. So now we'll just head back up to where we found our homegirl. With it hopefully being pretty much guard free. There's a VIP exit, by the way, which we can take her out through. So now we just gotta get back up to her. Emily, I'm coming, I swear! Okay, apparently I'm closing that shutter first, though. Okay. Heading on up. So that is the other option that you can do. You can torture a man through BDSM until it's not BDSM, it's torture. And he'll tell you what he wants you to hear. Hello! What are you doing in here? Who are you? Why are you wearing that mask? Corvo? You're wearing a mask to sneak around, aren't you? They, they, they told me you were head chopped off in, in the prison, dead, like, like mother. Not as it easily. Yeah, it does. You're not dead. Now we can leave. I have a plan. I almost got away twice. There's a special door to come and go for special people, and I'll show you. And if anyone tries to stop us, you can fight them. Sure can. All right, let's go, Squirt. It's this way. Before you go. Hold on. What all did you have in here? Boop, boop. Blow out these out, I guess. Ah, oh, that's cute. Okay, sorry. Emily, wait, I'm coming. Ah, there shouldn't be anybody that I killed. Well, I didn't kill. I'm sorry. I, actually, I don't. I didn't kill anybody, did I? No, not yet. I almost did. I almost did kill someone. I swung my sword at them at least once. So, yeah. Wait, hold on. Before we do this. Not only the return to Slack John with the say Okay, so oh, I don't have to take them out. I just have to give him the combo. Okay. Uh, I'm stuck. Okay, there we go. The door is locked. Unlock it so we can get away from this place. Just... Let's go to the distillery district. Aim the heart. Okay. Hey, Granny. Come on. It's good to see you again, dear. But don't dally, or that young girl might fall in the river. Thanks, Granny. Potions give you slightly more health. Oh, yeah. Yep. Mm, that sounds fantastic. White rats won't attack me. That was, that was helpful earlier. I don't think we really need that one. So, yeah. I will take better heals. Thank you. Thanks, Granny. Thank you. Thank you for the food. Mwah. You're my favorite granny. The only one I've got that's really long. Copper wire. Cool. Thank you. Thank you. 
Nothing like robbing the blind. Okay. Okay. Come on. So now we'll head back to Slackjaw. Give him the combination, and the Pendleton brothers will be in no more. Go to Dunwall Whiskey Distillery. Boop. Slackjaw! I have a present! And once we give this to him, I think we'll call it. Just this one's. Hey, bud. You brought me the numbers. I've been after this combination for months. If you ever need steady work, you come see me. Slackjaw knows a good man when he sees one. It's only natural that you'd be curious about what I intend to do with the Pendletons. See, the Pendletons got these rock mines. Have hundreds of souls working right. down there half a mile deep below ground. So I'm going to shave their heads and cut out their tongues and put them in one of their own stinking minds. Then they're going to see life from a different angle. Wow. Wow. That is rather intense, Slackjaw. Not going to lie. That's a uh, wow. <laughs> Dang. I'm going to shave their heads, cut out their tongues, and make them work in their own mind. That's fucked up, dude. I'm just going to say it. I mean, from what I understand, they're messed up people, so maybe they deserve it, but I don't know. I'll let you guys be the judge. I'm not going to make any radical calls like that. Is there a root? Is there a what? Ah. Wait. Ah. Where's that? How do I get to that? Ah, ah, ah. Ah, boop. And boop. What's in here? Have I been in here? I think I might have. Yeah, I think so. Yes, 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 I have. Didn't get that, though, last time. Useful. And then to there. Excellent. Wow. Lots of stuff in here. Spring razors. Rewire tool. Copper wire. Pouch. Awesome. There's all kinds of stuff in here. Bread. Oh, match this. Did I kill him? I sure hope not. It's gonna be very unfortunate if I did. Okay. I don't think I did kill him. Nope, okay. Just a second, sir. Boop! I have fun in there. Okay. So now we need to get back to the golden cat. So we'll go this way. Attention, Excuse me. Is this the right way? No way, maybe. Yes. Is it? No. Boop. Ah, piece of craps. No. Oh, that's annoying. Where's it? Where's that gonna put me at? Ah, resume from last save. Dang it! So if it puts me back outside of Slack Jaws, I'm just okay. Yeah, we're just going to ignore that one thing. Uh, which way? Was this way? Okay. We're gonna ignore that one bone charm. I didn't even look at what it was. So 
It's okay. So let's see. It was right there. That's where I need to go. Have you seen him? The handsome one with the beautiful dark eyes. I just want to tell him I'm doing my part. Yes, Granny Rags is. Oh, she's talking about the outside of the outside. Go to the golden cat. So I think we need to talk to Emily, and that's why she's not here. So we'll see. Boop. No. What? What now then? What? Journal. Return. Oh, just return. Okay, just return to Samuel. Okay, can do. Go to the distillery district. Let's go. Okay, there we go. Fussing with my collar, Mama. The dance is starting soon. Is my hair smooth enough? He should be there. Okay. Okay. You don't hear anything. Y'all right, have fun. Excuse me. Yeah, my ghost thing is. Ow. Woo. Oh, I got. Oh, what? 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 That's so dumb. I literally made it perfect. Did that freaking watchtower get me? Oh, fucking hell. Yes, 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 yeah. He's sure to be there. I know. Pardon me. Boop. 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 And boop. Hey, Sam. I met your friend Samuel. He's going to show me how to steer his boat. Are you both ready to go? Corvo, you must have worked wonders out there in the city tonight. I can't believe my old eyes. Ah, oh, you old coot, you. Yeah, let's go. Thanks, Sam. Right, there we go. Mission status. So, it didn't kill anyone, but chow, total chaos, but chow. So, help Slash off find Crowley and put the Pendletons to work in their own mind. Excellent. Hey. So, we did mm, not very good, but that's okay. Um, I'm not too worried about like some of the collectibles. Like the runes and bone charms, maybe I'm going to worry about. And I'm definitely not going to worry about getting all the coins, because that's four grand, and we'd be there forever. So cloth paintings, I don't know, but I'll try and find the out shri out out shri <laughs> outside of shrines when we can. But guys, that's gonna have to do it for now. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Go ahead and leave a comment down below. Let me know what you think so far. Ring that bell to keep notified when I update new videos. And don't forget to check out my Twitter and Patreon. They're both down in the descriptions. And after this cutscene, I'll see you guys in the next one. Take it easy. Grown-up business, girl. I mean, your ladyship. Forgive me. It's okay. I heard a lot of grown-up business at the Golden Cat. Oh. I should concentrate on piloting this boat. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I'm not supposed to talk after the outro, but that was really funny, Sam. <laughs> Young lady Emily, I'm Callista. I'll be caring for you and schooling you while you're with us. Pleased to meet you. As am I. Would you like to see your room in the tower? Can I see it? Yes, you may. Would you like you to see a room in the tower? Can I see it? Well, I just asked you. Pits. Good. I think I'll like it here. I'll go with Callista Corvo. I'll see you later. Bye. You do not fail to impress. Armed with a blade, you've changed the course of the city forever. And with the Pendleton twins gone, our own Lord Pendleton will assume their votes in Parliament. In one night, 
You've done more than most men do in a lifetime. I need to speak to you soon. But for now, Lord Pendleton requests your attention. All right. Thank you. But that'll have to wait till next time, guys. So, for real this time, hope you guys enjoyed this and take it easy.